another month. Wow. Hey, what's happening, everyone? I am your Dragon God of Gaming, Damian Dragon, and welcome back to another episode of You Guessed It Reading Your Comments. This month has been very, very, very stressful. Uh, I've, I'm actually extremely tired. I don't know if you guys can tell. I'm exhausted. Um, I've been hard at work. Um, I've been just, I've been on, uh, I've been on cruise control lately. So I'm sorry if I, I don't give it my all this time. I apologize, but I'm just, I'm just not here. Um, as, as you guys know, I've been, I recently, um, uh, introduced a new episode, well, a new channel called Game Over. And I am a hard at work over there with some new stuff. Uh, the newest episode came out on Friday. It's doing well. I've only got three subscribers over there so far, but, you know, uh, it's, it's always been a small process for me. So that's okay. I highly suggest that if you guys have not yet, go check out Game Over. And uh, come and support me over there. But right now, I want to uh, jump right in. Uh, I'm going to go for about 40 minutes this time. I'm sorry. Still, as I said, I'm tired. So let's get cracking. Okay. And my boy is back. I see that my boy is back. Mr. Media Lover is back on his roller coaster of commenting and i love to see it welcome back good man welcome back and he's been going gung-ho on everything as of lately nearly catching up with our episodes so far he hasn't hit luigi's mansion just yet but he's he's in november he he, he went hell <laughs> So, let's just get started. This is from a hotel of many problems, Celeste. Yeah, this place is the, isn't really good. But the luxurious mold, the floating laundry. Yeah, this place is not fucking good. Is it? <laughs> <laughs> I love uh, playing with the voices in this in this game. Uh, <laughs> so Celeste, Celeste, I felt really good about playing Celeste. I really did. My heart, oh my heart, it was so good. <clears throat> and yeah, he's. I'm pretty sure he's still going hard in it. So, good man. But this is uh, I believe this is one of the latest of Benny and the Ink Machines. I believe this is the lady spending the ink machine. What in the tune just happened here? Bending the ink machine. At 50 minutes, nice recap of the whole video. Up to four, we've met a nice Salas Angel and a very um, asshole-ish Boris. Don't know what they did to my Boris. <laughs> they fucked up my Boris. They massacred my boy. Salas Angel got fucking shish kebobbed. Sammy Lawrence got a fucking axe upside the head. Uh, the projector guy got his head ripped off. That's just a lot of shit that happened. <laughs> you know what I mean? So, yeah, there's a lot of shit that's going on in uh, Benny the Machine. If you haven't gone out yet, go check out the Need League Machine. Please and thank you. Um, I'm currently um I'm not doing Bendy and Ink Machine then the, the Dark Revival. I'm doing a game in the middle and then the Dark Revival. I'm actually done with uh the new game that's um the new game that's taking place of Bendy and Ink Machine. It's done. <laughs> so yeah. Uh I'm already done. Uh, recording and editing all the episodes that's going to be coming out for the episodes right after Bending the Machine. 
and what's happening with that. And I am on my way to getting Benier in the Dark Revival. I need a few months. <laughs> Uh, in the first part of December, I am taking a small break before I have to do the seven days of Christmas. Actually, I'm actually currently taking a break. Not, I, well, currently I'm not. I'm still working on Game Over. But I'm, um, well, it's a little bit more simpler for things on Game Over. But I'm taking a small sabbatical. <laughs> Trying to relax myself before I, you know, delve back in. But I haven't started on the seven days of Christmas just yet. I'm I'm actually waiting till the latter half of the month to uh start with any of the seven days of Christmas stuff because I still don't know what I want to do with seven days of Christmas. And then um as you guys know by the end of the year I can't touch anything until the midway point in December where you guys can uh you know, I see everything that has to do with Super Mario Galaxy. So, there's still a lot that's happening. <sighs> but yeah, in general, there's just so much. Anyway, I should keep I should keep going. I only have I have 35 minutes left. Jesus. Uh unfortunate timing. I always have unfortunate timing. I guess they do. <laughs> I have awful timing in this game. I It's not that it's unfortunate timing, it's more or less like they have a very weird cycle. And um speaking of a uh, game over, I should I, I keep on bringing it up because it's so you know, it's still relevant, Lord, Lord, Lord help me. <laughs> um, I was meant to do trophy hunting for uh, Ben Unique Machine. And I couldn't get through it all. So I scrapped the idea. And the reason why is because for some reason I could not, for the life of me, no matter how good I am, I could not get one of the trophies that has to do with uh, the... Fight in this actual episode, which is the fight right after Sammy Lawrence. One of the things is that I gotta beat more uh monsters than um Alice and Boris, but also you know stay alive and do it in I bet I believe two minutes. And it doesn't have a chapter select. And if I wanted to keep on trying, I would have to start way at the beginning of Chapter 5 while I was locked in the uh, chamber with Alice. And I just did that 12 to 13 times as I'm sitting here. And I was just like, I can't do it for some reason. I just can't do it. It's so weird. But yeah. <laughs> oh, great. They're back. Fucking hell. Yeah, Why you is it that my weapon gets taken anytime I fucking try my best? What's up with this little spot up here? I don't know. But yeah, the fucking... These fucks, the minute that I lose my weapons... Oh, they're here, they're here. <laughs> they really did not want me to whack them. Oh, lord. I'm sure nothing will go wrong here. <laughs> Why did your drinks be set? Nothing can go wrong. Yep. Pain. And bro was like a cat. He landed on his fucking feet. How, Sway? How? You tell me how you did that. I would love to know your secrets about Kitty Dumb. You what? You know what? I take that back. That sounded very furry like. Uh, we're gonna move on. <laughs> 
Yay, he trusts you now. I thought, well, because Alice, let's be the same. Please don't kill me. I appreciate you, buddy. <sighs> that was close. Oh, come on. Again. And that was the fight I was talking about. Um, That Boris, only trust me. Because of Alice Angel. Because of Alice. And only because of Alice. That's the only reason he trusts me. Because Alice said, you're going to trust him. <laughs> And he's just like, fuck. Well done, Tom. Dang, he's accurate. Hey, I think this is the Sammy Lawrence. Thing. Free you now. Free your head right off your shoulders. That's a hard ass line. It's time for. Oh, of course. Damn! Damn! Good night. C -c 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 combo over <laughs> I did that fight all over. Yeah, I, I didn't know. Well, did he survive? You know what? Did I? Oh, oh hello, Sammy. Sammy. I thought you got fucking off. I trusted you. I gave you Yeah, for I still don't know how he escaped Bendy. Obvi it's obvious that Bendy got into the room with him. How the fuck did you survive? How? How you do that? How you do that? Because the projection is sure the fuck did not make it. So I don't know how Sammy made it. I want to know how the fuck he made it. That's crazy. That's accurate, sadly. Once people fall into despair. Mm. Yeah. Same. Same, same. Never mind, I take it back. <laughs> yes, please. Oh, fun! Yeah, and <laughs> that hand was just like Mickey Mouse was just like, oh, I'm gonna put it onto the bank. Oh, I'm gonna fuck you up. Oh, if I kept doing this voice, that fucking Disney will get a hold of me. Oh, I don't want to have my lawyers. <laughs> I wonder what it could be. Yeah, this is what he means. There's something in the river. Oh, fun. There's something in the river? Yep. We found out what's in the river. We don't want to find out no more. Well, bye, I guess. Well, that's awful. I'm sorry. They really did this to me. Really, bro? I've seen what Henry looked like. And... He could fit through those fucking bars right there. He could. Man, Tom does not like you. <laughs> He's ready to get active. Bro over there. Bro over there ready to fuck me up. What did I even do? That, that is a very good question. What the fuck did I do to that bars? What did I do to him? Hmm. 
They certainly are wrong. Hmm. Where does it all lead to? Oh, fun. Nowhere. I followed them for a long time. Just leads me in circles. I don't think I meant to leave this place, Henry. But maybe... You are. Alice. Please let me out of here. Tom thinks you're dangerous. And what do you think? I... I think... You're the hope I've been waiting for. Go to sleep. Maybe tomorrow will be better. Like fucking hell it will. They sadly aren't wrong, weren't, weren't wrong. If you guys know the ending of this game, oh, don't worry. Next month you will. You guys know. You, you guys seen the hours at the ending. You guys will see. And yes, basically I just let it slip that next month is the finale of the game. It's funny seeing you confused about the lore. I actually wanted to talk about this. And I did write a little bit under here. I said I tend not to listen to lore much since it uh, impacts my thoughts of the game. That's very true. Um, I wanted to talk a, a little bit about this. Okay, I have a good amount of time. I want to talk a little bit about this because uh, there's a lot of lore episodes and things like Bendy and the Sheen, Dark Revival. Bendy the Cage, uh, yada, yada, yada. A lot of games that I play has a lot of lore to it. And there are some games, including the next one that I'm playing, uh, <laughs> um, has a lot of lore in it. I do watch some of the theories on it. But I make sure that they're spaced out between me listening to it and me playing it that I forget about what goes on and I form my own opinions. And I listen to mostly the lore videos. And mostly it comes off of game theory. I love the I love the theorist channel. I love game theory. I love film theory. I love food theory. I have not given South Theory that big of a try, but I'm willing to watch. And I've seen a lot of the lore stuff that they uh, do, and I love it all. And some of the ideas from uh, Game Theory, I do look at to do videos on. I really do. This is what got me into wanting to play Benny and the Ink Machine as much as I did. Because it wasn't just you guys wanting me to play it. It was the fact that I seen it so much, and I'm just like, this looks fun. But I do not have a place for it just yet. And that's the thing. It's always with these games, I need a place for them. I don't want to just put a mountain into the ether and they just, you know, sing. I want them to be in a place where they're special and they get the attention that they do need. Why do you think I do these kind of things like I do every single month? I want you guys to pick up the game where I can put my intention into the game. Where I can put all my attention, my thought process into this game. And that's why I like to do. And of course, on the Sunday videos, I put my attention into these things. When the primary videos are done, the Sunday videos get my attention. And then when the Sunday videos are mostly done, because the Sunday videos have been done for a good bit, after the primary videos, lately I've been putting the my thought process into the week of threes videos and all that, where my mind can just physically process and I can make sure that all these things are as good as they possibly can be. My reactions are genuine. I don't like seeing things ahead of time. And when I do try to see things ahead of time, I either try to forget them as fast as possible, or I try not to spoil shit that could ultimately make a decision for me when it comes to my reactions. I like my reactions to be as genuine as physically possible when I see them. And when I seen, you know, Bendy and the projectionist fighting, I remembered after the fact that I seen it in real time. I was just like, Jesus. I do. I do. God, you. <laughs> oh, that, that's the thing. It's the difference here that I love to do. I know the lore. 
the problem is that if I try to take my mind out of the lore as much as physically possible, so my reactions can be as genuine as possible. I have seen the Bendy and the Ink Machine theories before. I know Thomas Connor. I know the actress behind uh, the good Alice Angel, that a lot of them were, you know, the ones that weren't, you know, coming back to these things. I know Henry was probably, you know, sacrificed in the Ink Machine alongside of, like, the... Uh, the woman who played the evil Alice Angel um, and the projectionist and all that, Sammy Lawrence, who was the music producer and all that fucking noise and shit. I know all of that. <laughs> Believe me, I do. But the funny thing is, and this is the good thing, I have not looked up anything for Benny and the Dark Revival just yet. I listened to the originals, and the last time I heard and I, I watched some of the newer theories now. I don't really go back to the older ones. And I purposely now stay away from the Bendy theories so that I won't be influenced on what comes next. And the last time I heard from the Dark Revival was about a year and a half ago. So I don't know too much going into the new game. So, and that's kind of the way I want to stay. So, I know the lore. <laughs> I know it. Damn, I talked for five fucking minutes. <laughs> but, what was my reaction? I came for you. I came for you. I came for you. He still wants to get active with me. With this Boris. He hates you. <laughs> oh, well, I noticed. It looks like he's ready to fucking off me. <laughs> he was. Henry? Here, you must be hungry. Thank you. Sorry, it's all we have. Alice was... Alice was like the mother. And I like that. There are different versions, so like Dragon does not know. Well, I technically Did I do just now. Be Boris. Confused. I am confuzzled. And uh, you guys did. Uh, I think I forgot what during this episode that I've seen many different fucking Boris's oft when I was looking, um, when I was actually going to meet the uh, Alice Angel. Uh, the evil Alice Angel during chapter two or three. I'm not sure. I forgot which one. I believe it was chapter three. Anyway. <laughs> one question. What was she trying to do here? Good question. And I have zero answers. Yeah, I don't have, I, I don't have answers for this. Oh, I think she was planning to strangle me. Damn! The fuck? Alice Angel? What? What the fuck? And hey, she got Boris. Did I just not just be Boris? They are blobs. And they're blobs with souls. Yeah. <laughs> Just, yeah. <laughs> but I don't know what she was planning on doing. By the looks of it, she just, it looked like she went to strangle me. I don't know how quick this Alice Angel was. But she, the good Alice Angel was not there one moment, and then both of them were there the next moment. They were quick. Damn. Poor Boris. He didn't deserve that. Yeah. Why can't you ever just die? Okay. I don't figure out what the fuck to do. Thank you, my boy, Jack. 
Okay, because there was a phone there. You know what I mean? Oh, Boris. <gasps> Boris! Oh no, what has she done to you? Oh, hell no! I did my boy dirty. You know what? My boy. <laughs> my boy. Oh, cool, I'll build him five. This is what I mean. Yeah, this was not the smartest idea. Please don't. As I said. Legitimate reaction. As I said, legitimate reaction. <laughs> I'm not gonna reply. Uh, uh, yeah, that's a good idea. Don't ask any questions. You don't want to. Then, but two minutes, and there's already pro already a problem. Of two. Yeah, this episode was kind of a shit storm for me. Oh, really? Actually, one minute and 52 seconds. Yeah. Good on you, man. I, did I was so to, happy. Uh, this took me an hour. I knew where everything was. So, I, I was really happy that I got to. I was so happy when I got it done. I was just like, oh, fucking hell. Thank God. I was. I, I was. <laughs> I was sitting there. I was just like, oh, my God. I was doing that on, on uh, Twitch, too. Just sitting there. Ding, 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 ding. Fuck. Ding, 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 ding. Damn it. Ding, 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 ding. Fuck. I was just sitting there shooting for the fences. Those are two creepy mascots, guys. He was, we just go to ignore them. Yeah. Today. Yeah. Yeah, no. We don't call attention to that. There's no attention to those. Not at all. Oh, which way am I putting it? Oh, oh, yeah. Over here. We don't pay attention to that. Every time I pay attention to something like that, I have my ass handed to me. That's a no-no. That's a big no no. But that's that's a no sir. That is a no sir. Mm mm. Nah. No. Skipper. You didn't see anything. Thank you. <laughs> you didn't see anything. We didn't see anything. We're gonna pretend like we didn't see nothing. Cool? Cool. That was loud. That's that's one way of cleaning the mess. This game's art style is incredible. Lord. I wish laundry would just do that. <laughs> if my room can pick itself up, well, to be honest, my room is. Besides needing a fucking dust clean. Besides needing a dust clean. My room is practically spotless. 
and I always have all my stuff already, you know, put put away. I don't like shit on the floor. Never liked shit on the floor. Um, if that shit could put it away like that, that's what that's that would be fucking amazing. I wouldn't need to do shit. Happy. Hit a button. Yes. Anyway, fifty-two sixteen, a charming moment into the mate to the matrix hello well this was amazing this was amazing what the fuck celeste and celeste <laughs> this was so cute an actual a an, an episode of oh an episode of celeste inside of celeste I think this is where uh, Celeste uh, came to be. I think. If you guys think that I was doing any of the uh, the stuff when it came to uh, the strawberries, oh, this is the first level. Yeah, it is. But without the climbing. It's it's very cute. It is very cute. Maybe that was like the first like beta version of what Celeste came out to be, like a more arcadey style. And I thought that actually was very cute. It was very thought provoking. I loved it to pieces. Forty eight fifty seven. You got a point. I'm glad you think. I'm running a world class establishment here. I don't have time to wait around for meandering guests. The walls are coming to life! The fuck you mean, meandering guest? You can fly! It cannot! In flesh! You're fine! <laughs> you really don't have to wait for me. You're just looking for a way to do the place. I'm about nine minutes, but yeah. The walls are coming to life. And you're worried about waiting for me? Fucking asshole. Why did that make me laugh? 42, 14. The mold is blinking! <laughs> Y'all see that shit? The mold is blinking! Rough shape doesn't actually acquire this. There is living fucking fungi. And I thought Toad was a living fungi. <laughs> is it really open for business? <laughs> of course we're open. Because the walls were literally coming to life. There was nothing. Nothing that could prepare you for mold that blinks at you. If Shit on your wall started blinking at you. And the first thing you don't do is run the fuck out of that room? You crazy. If my wall started blinking at me, I'm out. I will never come back here. <laughs> Besides to grab my equipment. But after that, <laughs> I will never. All reference. It's like the fucking... It looks like the Overlook Hotel on this bitch. Well, all we need is a fucking axe murderer. I love shoving in little references in places that if I knew. You know what's funny? That I was actually... In that moment, I was thinking about either the axe murderer, which is Jack, or the... All we need... Uh, I was, a part of my mind wanted to say... All we needed was the twin standing at the end of the hall. Oh my god. 3824. That had no right being as dumb as it was. Do you have a back exit? You know, I can still hear you, right? 
<laughs> he got shut down real quick. Nice joke, lol. Luigi would already be down the mountain. <laughs> Can I help you? Are you a ghost? Holy shit! Luigi! Fuck! He's here now! He's here now! <laughs> That was funny. Around the time while I was making Celeste, I did not know what I was going to be putting after Celeste. <laughs> to be honest, I did not know how long the game was until the very last episode. And then I realized, fuck. <laughs> when I realized that I was almost there, I was just like, damn, I'm going to need something after this. And right after I was, um, during this these episodes, I was, um, not during these episodes, but right after I was done editing the episodes, um, I went off and played Luigi's Mansion 2, which is being played right now. And I had no idea that each other were go they, they were going to come <laughs> into contact with each other. So that joke is very tough. About <laughs> that joke was completely unplanned. Gravity Falls is probably one of the funniest cartoons. <laughs> Whoa! This is worthless. <laughs> I love gravity. Oh, I'm going to need to start getting keys. One of my favorites is Mabel. I I love I absolutely love and adore Mabel. Mabel is fucking funny. Why is the key up there? And one of the one of the phrases that I do use from time to time is "eeny meeny miny you." I use that a lot, and I also love the gra the Gravity Falls stuff that's currently going on. My lord, I've been watching it on film theory. I fucking love what's going on with Gravity Falls. Some of my friends love it too, and. I do know that uh, me, a lover, you've been looking into Gravity Falls yourself. I keep an eye up. I hear you. Good question, 35. Why is there a hotel up here? Who built this? <laughs> and why? That's a very good question. With, not, with no answers. As I said, and no answers. After all the shit you just went through climbing up. Again, watch this episode. For all the shit you got through climbing up here, who wants to stay in a resort? Would it be worth it? Yeah. But then you see the resort. Yeah. And probably more weights. I had 34 deaths, my god. Oh. I wish I could tell you you were wrong, but I can't. I can't. I can't say that you're wrong. Again, such beautiful art. I'm having altitude death. Archaeology. The art is good. I heard another thing called. I heard another thing with the uh, with art in his name. I am currently working on things. Hopefully, he has good art. I heard it was very chill. You know, I like chill art. I don't know. You tell me. Why are some other good games with some good art? I would love to know. I would love to know. Anyway. Yeah, it's things letting you know that it gets serious. Probably. 
Oh, you're having no, another panic attack? Are you having another panic attack? I know people with panic attacks, and Lord have mercy. What do you mean another? That's a very good question. Focus on your breathing, honey. I'm here. What's going on? That's someone who's been through it so many times that they just know there are some things you don't want to go through over and over again. Speaking from experience. There are some problems that you just don't want to see over and over again. That shit changes you. I lost it here. Oh, my help. <laughs> I'm Theo, by the way. An adventurer from a far off land. It's called Pound Town. <laughs> I don't know how I can make these jokes. <laughs> She's 19, at least it is said. We are in the clear for fucked up jokes. <laughs> I am so fucking careful. I am so fucking careful when it comes to dirty jokes around kid kind of characters. Why? I am not going to be named a lolly lover. We are not going there! Fimo looks out for me there. If there's a joke to be made, it will be looked up first. If the joke is there, I will fucking be able to find it. If not, it gets cut. <laughs> Alright. I, I will do the rest of uh, these because, well, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. <laughs> oh god. I'll, yeah, I'll do the rest of these. Anyway, well, at least I'll do some of them. 31, 30, 31, 23. Surprise. I'm wanting the same thing. Time to give up and go home. What the fuck? Ah! The fuck was that? Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck off. Hang on, media lover. This was not a good surprise. You ruined my surprise party. The fuck? <laughs> I'm fucking with you. But that's a horrible surprise, just letting so you know. And the chase is over. For now. God. I outran her. Uh. Fuck. I'm sorry, I had to see that. Not in for the story. Okay, but <laughs> I swear to God, this is why you guys picked this game. <laughs> Let's see him suffer! Hey, uh, media lover, you kind of, uh... Kind of tipped your hand there a little bit. Why do you like seeing me suffer, bro? Why do you, why do you and Lumi find reasons to torture me? <laughs> what did I do to y'all? What did I do? That was so heinous. That's, you're going to find a way to torture me. <laughs> what did the dragon do? <laughs> I don't know. It's, for some reason, you and Lumi find ways. And I, I, I swear to God, you guys devise plans that I don't see to find ways to fuck with me. To send me into the most brutal shit possible. 
And yes, I've been playing some of those games that everyone requested. I am not okay mentally. <laughs> I am not okay mentally. I am not here. Not at all. I was about to say that. And yes, that basically says that I've, I've been playing a lot of you guys' suggestions. What's wrong with y'all? <laughs> and I mean, I've played everything. Everything. What is wrong with y'all? I'm fucking with you guys. Actually, some of them, some of them were actually pretty fun. Actually, one of those games inspired me to play another game. Another oh, set no. of games. You want to explain to me why purple hair can do shadow clone jutsu? <laughs> Fimo wants to learn too. <laughs> well, apparently she had Naruto as a teacher. That's why. <laughs> Yeah, you know, I was like, why is there like six of her now? And why are they all planning to jump me? <laughs> Damn, it's like going into and watching some Jujutsu Kaisen. You'll see motherfuckers get jumped. And the chase begins. Run. Run. Oh. Oh, she's trying to get me. I never thought I would say such a dumb statement. Of course, she's after me. She did not have to say that. That was a stone cold burn. Are you the weak part of me or the lazy part? <laughs> that bitch needs some ointment because. That shit was a burn. That was a third degree burn. She needs a burn unit for that shit. Mmm. You're kind of right. It's sad I am. Rose, darling, slow down. Why do you look like you were just really fucking high? I'm sure there's a lot of writers that have been high when they were making their shit. I don't know if this developer does. There's one thing I know for sure. Whoever was making the show Ed, Ed, and Eddie were on something. And I say this because I've watched a good amount of Ed, Ed, and Eddie. They were on something. Don't know what, but they were on something. That is the truth, Ed Boy. You do not mess with the son of a shepherd! 1651, it really is. That's actually pretty cool. I love the I love these mechanics. For as much as I say, and I don't care, I love the mechanics of this game. This, in and of itself, was fucking cool. These mechanics were just fucking crazy. Really? I could not grasp them. I don't know what the fuck I was trying to do. And I do not remember. The flow was amazing, as I said. Oh, look, it's a mirror. Nope, I refuse. Why am I pick? Oh. Hey. What? What the fuck? Kind of wild. Yeah. This is why you don't trust mirrors, kids. 
Such a beautiful illustration. Forsaken. Chapter complete. Again, the art is crazy. Only. The art in this game is all amazing. Just incredible. Very fair reaction. The fuck off me! This might have been a mistake. You fucking think? Who climbs up a mountain for fun? I know there's some of you. There's nearly 900 of you here. There's 893. We're nearing 900. I know one of you. One of you. Statistically. Like mountaineering. Or would like to go mountaineering. There's one of you. 1335. Dope. Yes, sir. I <laughs> had 20 deaths. Ah, and that counter is just going to keep on getting higher. The best, best motivation anyone can have. You can do this. I need that kind of courage meant to get out of bed in the morning. <laughs> And that's because I'm fucking lazy in the morning. Don't want to get up. No. How about no? But it's about 10 a.m. and I need to get up and start fucking editing. Ugh. I need that kind of encouragement in the morning. I'm just sitting there, just like, just like this. I just need a fucking, like, a military fucking music. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> to work. I need that kind of encouragement. You can do this. <laughs> Actually, no. Nah, it's more like, you can do this. Here's a cup of coffee. Come on. <laughs> Thanks, bird. Bonus friend. You know. <laughs> That's a very nice bird. Nice bird. 320 to 451. I'm going to have the time of my life with this series. I told you you would have. I was excited. The sign our friend is busted. Is this the mine trail? <laughs> You're almost there. It's just across the bridge. You too. By the way, you should call someone about your driveway. The bridge collapsed. I nearly died. I look like a fucking saw trap, for God's sakes. <laughs> <laughs> if my driveway almost did you in, the mountain might be a bit much for you. I still shoot this bitch! <laughs> she looks like she wants to! <laughs> <laughs> if an old bat like you can survive out here, I think I'll be fine. <laughs> I need that bird to get back. Oh, the back smack. Suit yourself. But you should know, Celeste so Mountain is a strange place. You might see things. Things you aren't ready to see. Always see. Exactly what my husband said before he had heart failure. Damn! Damn! I regretted that. <laughs> You should seek help, lady.
I made a great decision. I made a great decision. What a great start in 251. Oh, God. Whoops. Skipper! You didn't see anything. Thank you. Well, that was close. Emotional damage! Oh, God. Skipper! You didn't see anything. I'm just gonna need I'm gonna just gonna need to pay him to be on reserve. Could swear. Could swear. Alright, here we go. I'm not even finished watching the video and it's a banger. Y'all go watch this. Go watch the recent one. That is gonna shape up the finale of C it's the CPU Civil War tournament next month. I can't wait for you guys to see the ending. I cannot wait. Hippity skippity. I made I corrected a mistake. <laughs> and I will be premiering the video. And I'm going to try to get Byleth on. Anyway, I think I, I did a good amount. There's a lot more. I did read them all. I did list them all from Alice Angel goes berserk to the last of the Lego City Undercover. That was just a lot there. So, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you guys enjoyed. I was supposed to go with 40 minutes. I went, I, I went my normal hour. So, I still hope you enjoyed. Thank you guys so much. Thank you guys so much for listening. I appreciate you. I hope everyone has a beautiful day. And I hope everyone enjoyed. If you guys have not yet, like. Comment, subscribe. That's his tradition. Hold on. Roll the clip! I believe thou meant to say, right if this way if. <laughs> Someday, but not today. That wasn't that funny. Anyway, now, thank you so much for watching. If you guys have not yet, like, comment, subscribe. Getting all the action, the fun that we need to end with the Dragon Guide of Gaming. So come and join in, see what we got. There's always so fun happening. So be here, be square, or get kicked in the rear. You guys know we do things. With all that being said, thank you guys. And next time you guys see me back here for reading your comments, will be the year end of uh, these episodes. It'll be the last one of 2024. So. Bring your best. See you guys next time. Peace. See you guys then.